Hey, it's Tom Z with Traction Real Estate Mentors, and in this quick video, we're gonna go driving for deals in a different town as we define a farm area. Keep it rolling and stay tuned. One of the things you need to do when you think about defining a farm area or starting to invest in a new city, you gotta look at a number of different things. One, it helps to get to know the neighborhoods. The best way of getting to know the neighborhoods is simply to drive them. Drive around, look and see what you see. What kind of houses do you see? How do you feel in the different types of neighborhoods? It all makes a big difference. And make sure you pay attention to the road. Look, I got the whole family in the car. <laughs> so we are currently in Wichita, Kansas today. Wanted to check out Wichita because I think we have solid rents and solid cash flows and uh, good stable people with a good bit of jobs and the kind of ever-changing uh, legal environment of a given state. Does it make any sense or not? That's kind of been a, that's been a moving target lately. But you look at the kind of homes and you look at bread and butter homes and what we'll do is analyze what's the average price in these neighborhoods and what's the average rent. And also as you're driving for deals, take a look. You might come across one that's uh, boarded up. So we need to make note of that. So that is 821 South Pershing Street. So 821 South Pershing. I'll grab that off the video later and then we'll uh, start to try to find the owner. Now, why is that boarded up and can we turn that into a deal? What's that worth when it's rented? How much does it rent for and how much does the PITI, the principal interest taxes and insurance comes out to? Because uh, when we know that number, then we can figure out how much the cash flow is. So if you are trying to get to know your town, because you remember, you can do all this real estate investing in your own town. Um, or if you want to be in a different town, maybe that's where you want to move someday. Maybe it's where you're from. Maybe it's where you have family, somewhere you like to visit. Maybe where your kids go to school or where your kids live. You can do real estate investing anywhere. There are always houses that need to be fixed up. There are always people that get into situations that they need to sell their home. Uh, pretty much everywhere there is a mayor. There's another, uh, there's another board up and I'm going to have Carolina note the address. <laughs> so you're driving around looking and see what you think. Remember there's all, no matter where you are, people say, where's, where's it best to do uh, wholesaling anywhere? Where's the best to do rehabbing anywhere? Where's the best to be a landlord? Almost anywhere. Again, you want to pay attention to with good cash flows, uh, which usually means uh, less expensive properties, uh, but with solid uh, rents. And you want to pay attention when you're a landlord, especially to the legal laws to make sure that you're not going to be uh, stuck in a very landlord unfriendly state. So let this guy through because he has no idea what I'm doing that I'm filming. So that is uh, how we start to analyze. And you notice uh, if you're looking at the houses in the background, even just a couple blocks from where I started, the housing stock has changed. It's gotten a little bit nicer down at this end of the neighborhood. So that interests me because the stuff that's right on that border um, might be able to, if it's fixed up nice, it might be able to capture some of the higher prices of this end of this neighborhood uh, than the other end. So just different things that we're looking for as we go. So driving for deals has got to be a key part of your marketing. It's also a key part of understanding uh, your neighborhoods. It's a key part of understanding what we call your farm area, a farm area you can establish no matter where you are. So here, uh, for the whole Zeeb family, Tommy, Carolina, and Tom Zeeb, for Traction, uh, wait, wait, and Dominic. So for it's all of us for Traction Real Estate Mentors, signing off.